The movie starts with Danny, who is sleeping, but suddenly an explosion happens that wakes her up. Danny's father quickly takes Danny to a safe place. Danny's father then goes back to the scene of the chaos to save other people, but unfortunately, her father is thrown by a creature and dies. Danny sees her father die in vain and runs away, but something chases her until Danny falls and faints. Danny wakes up in a room with her hands handcuffed. She tries to scream and call someone, and someone comes who is a doctor. She is Dr. Reyes. Dr. Reyes claims to be a doctor who will treat Danny until Danny recovers. She tells Danny that Danny is the only survivor of the tornado that happened in her area. Dr. Reyes takes Danny to a room and lets her sleep. The next day, Dr. Reyes and four other mutants, Roberto, Sam, Rane, and Ilyana, gather to discuss so that Dr. Reyes can help them get rid of their trauma. But none of them want to talk about the trauma they experienced. Danny joins them and sits with them. Dr. Reyes asks Rane to tell her what happened in her past. Rana tells her that she can change and accidentally killed a priest. After Rana finishes telling her story, Dr. Reyes asks Ilyana to tell her about her trauma, but Ilyana refuses and leaves. Ilyana then takes Danny out of the building. Danny sees the gate open and asks if there is no guard if she leaves. Ilyana says that Danny can leave whenever she wants. Danny ran out of the hospital, but suddenly she hit a wall like an invisible barrier. Danny realizes that she is being played by Ilyana and tries to attack her. Danny then sees a tall clock tower and climbs up. She breaks the clock and intends to jump from the top of the building, but Rani comes in and says that everything will be fine and suicide won't solve the problem. Rana extends her hand to Danny and pulls her back into the building. Danny and Rana leave the building and meet Dr. Reyes. They see Sam flying and trying to control his power. Rani then takes Danny back to her room. Before Rana leaves, Danny thanks her for being her friend in this place. The next day, Danny meets Rane, who is bathing. Danny asks what the meaning of the tattoo on Rane's back is, but she refuses to talk about it and leaves Danny. After bathing, Dr. Reyes gathers all the mutants again. Dr. Reyes teaches them meditation to control their emotions. After meditating, the mutants gather in the middle room. When Danny joins them, Ilyana mocks Danny that Danny's face looks like an Indian buffalo tribe. Sam tries to stop Ilyana, but Danny forbids him. Danny then takes Ilyana's doll, and a fight ensues. Ilyana unleashes her power and attacks Danny, but luckily Dr. Reyes arrives and stops their fight. Dr. Reyes then takes Danny and Ilyana to a small and dark isolation room and leaves them there. Danny falls asleep in the isolation room and dreams of seeing something in the snow. Suddenly, a creature from the dark shadows tries to attack her. Dr. Reyes, who realizes that something is wrong, comes to the isolation room and sees Danny's body covered in blood. The next day, Dr. Reyes takes a blood sample from Danny and examines what her power really is. After being examined by Dr. Reyes, Danny heads to Rana's room and meets Sam, who invites her to join him in the attic. There, they play truth or dare. Sam is hooked up to a lie detector and Rana asks him why he always carries coal in his hand. Sam tells her that the coal is the last thing his father gave him before he died in an accident. After Sam tells his story, Ilyana is hooked up to the lie detector. Danny asks her why she came here. Ilyana answers that she killed 18 men. The next day, Dr. Reyes gathers all the mutants to discuss. Dr. Reyes suggests that they move to her superior's facility. Sam refuses to move and wants to be released. The next morning, Dr. Reyes takes another blood sample from Danny and asks her what she last remembers before arriving at the hospital. Suddenly, Danny starts to hallucinate and sees a flashback of Dr. Reyes's memory. Ilyana's room is suddenly visited by a smiling man. Rani, who is taking a bath, is also visited by the priest she killed. Rani, who is scared, starts to turn into a wolf but the priest steps on her hand and places a hot iron with the letter W on her neck. Danny and Dr. Reyes, who hear Rani's scream, rush out and approach Rani. Rana has already turned into a wolf and runs out of the bathroom. Rani, who is exhausted, turns back into a human. Ilyana realizes that Danny's power is to manifest the greatest fear of someone. Ilyana attacks Danny and chokes her. Danny briefly sees Ilyana's greatest fear and gives her an illusion of the smiling man so Ilyana releases her grip. The next day, Danny visits Ilyana and apologizes for what happened yesterday. 
Ilyana starts to tell her that last night she saw the Smiling Man. The Smiling Man is a monster that looks like a man and always makes children cry. Then, in another place, Dr. Reyes receives a message from her boss that Danny's power is very dangerous and Danny must be destroyed. After visiting Ilyana, Danny goes to Rani. Danny apologizes to Rani for hurting her. Rani forgives Danny and says that she knows Danny had no control at that time. Soon, Dr. Reyes calls Danny for an examination. Rana asks Dr. Reyes for permission to accompany Danny, but Dr. Reyes forbids her. After Rana leaves, Dr. Reyes takes Danny to a secret place. Dr. Reyes ties Danny's hands and puts on a breathing device. Dr. Reyes says that this is all to make Danny calm when examined. In another place, when Ilyana and Sam open the door, Ilyana sees herself when she was little, and suddenly a tall man in black comes to the bed. The man turns out to be the smiling man, Ilyana's greatest fear. In another place, Dr. Reyes injects Danny with a sedative. Dr. Reyes prepares a body bag, and Danny, who realizes that she will be killed, starts to panic and tries to scream. Rane, who is a mutant wolf, has the hearing and smell of a wolf. She emerges from an air duct and attacks Dr. Reyes. She then opens a toxic gas valve to wake Danny up. Meanwhile, Ilyana and Sam are still trying to escape from the smiling man. They are surrounded from both sides and cannot run away. Ilyana, who is too scared, uses her power to escape and leaves Sam behind. Sam, who is cornered, is forced to use his power to move fast. He meets Roberto, who tries to break the door, but the exit is blocked by a barrier, which is Dr. Reyes's power. They change their route and intend to go to the attic, but they are stopped by a group of smiling men. Suddenly, Ilyana appears and slashes all the smiling men. Rane, Dani, Sam, Ilyana, and Roberto gather in Dr. Reyes's room. Rane tells her friends that Dr. Reyes just tried to kill Danny and that they are not being treated in the hospital, but rather being trained as killers. Danny suggests that they escape from the hospital and says that the only way to get out of the hospital is to kill Dr. Reyes. Rane uses her smell to find Dr. Reyes. They finally find Dr. Reyes, who is dying. Dr. Reyes comes out and explains that she will save them except Danny. Dr. Reyes then uses her power and presses Danny until Danny cannot move and has trouble breathing. Danny, who is desperate, starts to imagine her greatest fear. The room around them starts to shake. A giant bear breaks into the room and eats Dr. Reyes alive. Sam and Ronnie then carry Danny out of there. Ilyana bravely fights the bear monster so that the others can escape. Ilyana opens a portal and pulls out her sword arm. Ilyana, who is outside, finally fights the bear monster. Meanwhile, her friends run to a church. Sam, who is worried about Ilyana, decides to go out and join the fight against the monster. Rana takes Danny into a room to hide, but soon the bear monster breaks into the church and tears the top of the room where Ron and Danny are hiding. Luckily, Sam and Ilyana manage to get in and save Ron and Danny. Ron tries to wake Danny up, but Danny is still unconscious. Ilyana continues to fight the bear and is thrown out of the church. Seeing Ilyana cornered, Roberto finally unleashes his power and turns into a human torch. Roberto tries to hit the bear, but he is defeated. Rani also joins the fight and attacks the bear, but she is easily beaten by it. The bear is about to eat Rani, but Danny wakes up and tells the monster to stop. Danny stands up and faces the bear monster calmly. Danny approaches it and tries to calm it down. Danny manages to overcome her greatest fear, and the bear monster slowly disappears. Danny, Ilyana, Rani, Sam, and Roberto, who are now safe, intend to leave the hospital together. And the movie ends. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe. Because by subscribing, you have supported me to make better videos. See you in the next video. Two.